Oh no! 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 My companion cube! Hey guys, I'm LB and they just- They taunted me with a companion cube! How could they? How could they? What is even happening? Holy crap! Uh... Oh my! Okay then! Well, uh... <laughs> That's, uh, yeah, we are in Dilapidation Part 4. This entire series was requested by Agenta1999, and the series is made by Lone Wolf 2056 Very hard difficulty. Well, the last time you told me that, it wasn't true, so we'll see. I mean, it is from 2013. They- they thought- they thought easy maps were hard back then. The malfunctioning lift is taking you deep into the dark ruins of Aperture Laboratories. And there's a playthrough. Right, well... That was certainly an introduction to a map, if I do say so myself. Oh wow, that's completely dislocated. Pretty sure we would just die if we jumped down that tube. Oh no! There's another companion cube to taunt me! It's not even moving, it's just in the tube. Why would you do this? Why would you do this to me? Really? That light is shining down here? Because it seems like there's like a little a nub right there that would block the light from going here. I don't know. Maybe maybe we're in an alternate alternate universe here where lights behave different. What the heck? That's a very <laughs> strange picture right there. That looks like a ring. But uh, yeah, we'll just go with alternate universe physics. Interesting. Whoa! Now that is a sound effect. I guess we need to walk on that. I mean, it lets me walk on it. Oh, I still have I still have Portal One sounds from yesterday's map. Okay. <laughs> is there anything interesting? Oh crap! Oh, is this the way we have to go? No, this door does not work. But they certainly taunt me with the ability to, to go up to it. Hmm. Okay, this door works. Interesting. Right, so what's over here? We have a button that drops a cube into the funnel. Will it auto-respawn when it touches the fizzler? Yes, it will. Interesting. Let's bring it over here, shall we? What does that button do? Do you think that button turns off this fizzler? Cause that'd be my guess. How will we get in there, though? Like, I could just jump in there. Yeah, you could just jump in there. Don't think it's intended, though. And we can't really do anything once in here, so... Let's strike that out. What else... might we do? I don't think we'd want to send it back to land on that button. I don't even think we could. Yeah, I don't think we can do that. The timing would be way too precise anyway, even if we could. So let's check in here. Maybe we can't do anything in that room just yet. Well, it says this is the first thing we need to do. That says it's the second. That's the third, supposedly. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Can we do anything here yet, or do we need the other cube? That's what I don't know. The question becomes, how do we press that? Does anything reverse this funnel? It doesn't look like it. Y 
You know what, maybe I'm just supposed to let this fizzle over and over. Maybe I'm not even supposed to get it out. That might make a bit more sense. Ah, yeah, that makes perfect sense, actually. Yeah, that's how we do it. Yeah. Alright, so then we do this. And eventually it'll come to us. There we go. I wanna turn... the thing off. I'll just leave it there for now. But let's head over here into number two. Are you kidding me? Did you really make a map that has this? Mm-hmm. Here. What is going on here? What a weird map. Do I need the cube or something? I guess I need to bring the other cube in. So, let's go work on that, I suppose. Let's try this. Oh, maybe the light bridge is to let us lift the cube off the button. That might make sense. It's still a bit... silly, though. I mean, there's not a puzzle challenge here, it's just a can-you-do-things-when-you're-supposed-to... Yep. What does this do? Oh, is that permanent? Yeah, I guess that's the permanent shortcut. Oh, that fizz- I mean, that funnel is moving fast! Look at that! Look how fast that's moving! Well, you know what... Oh, it's even aim-assisted for me! Fancy that! Yeah, so far this is not raiding very hard for me. Maybe the very hard part is coming up. Cause so far the raiding for this map is very easy. Oops. Well, we have two cubes now. A regular cube and a laser cube. Let's go see what we can do with them. Okay, so. Can't open the exit yet, because we need three cubes for that, and a funnel. Alright. What do we have in here? You know, I'm kind of wondering why I needed two cubes to come in here. Because... there's a fizzler before I enter, so I can't bring either of them in. They're not necessary for the puzzle in here. Unless they are, which would be kinda neat, having to, like, swap them in and out, but... I don't think so. It's a 2013 very hard map, so it's gonna be easy. We got a cube. What happens... oh, it turns off the physical course. Sure, why not. So... If we then... do... this, what happens then? Uh-huh. A light bridge, huh? I 
assuming this allows us to step on this button without walking through the fizzler? Oh, but that just reverses the... funnel. Interesting. Can we shoot the funnel more here? I wonder. No. The answer to that question is no. Okay, so this is definitely more of a puzzle than the previous two rooms. And that, I appreciate. Is this intended? I almost feel like it's not, but... This must be intended. So I'm guessing we don't need... the light bridge anymore. we get... the cube in there? Oh. Really? I just need to... put it in there myself? And then shoot my black portal? Oh, okay. Well, that's... <laughs> that's a bit easier than what I was expecting, that's okay. There we go, we have this now. And then... to get it in there... What would be the best way to do this, actually? Yeah, it doesn't- that doesn't stay off. Maybe I do need to swap cubes or something. Huh. Well, let's try it. Oh, right, yeah. That's, a uh, good point. Because we'd easily get this one back by solving that easy puzzle again. But this is interesting. Because we don't have a way to take this cube out right now. At least not that I can see. I guess we could get it in there, but we wouldn't be able to keep the funnel, is the issue. Yeah, that doesn't turn off the laser field, so... I guess we don't need that funnel, then. So let's try doing this puzzle again. Da-da-da! Da-da-da! There we go. So then, yeah, do this. There's that. And then... What do we do? Because now the issue is that I need to get this cube in here. <laughs> While also keeping the funnel. Huh. I 
I have an idea. I have an idea. And it's really clever, if it's true. It doesn't make the map very hard. It does make it medium, though. Get out of there. Okay, I think we can just leave this here. Yeah, cause this is turned off. So we don't actually have to resolve this entirely. I wonder if that'll work. It should. Yeah! I like that, I like that. That doesn't make the map very hard, it just makes it medium. I'd consider that medium difficulty. Yeah! I like that. That's clever. Good cube swap puzzle. So. The clean cube goes up here. Into the clean button. Wait, I can... Come on. There we go. Let me put each of these cubes in here. I actually like this one. I mean, the individual puzzles were kind of... meh. I didn't really enjoy the individual puzzles, but I did like the overall overarching puzzle, which is neat. I don't know, I have mixed feelings. Let me know what you guys think. Anyway... Oh my goodness! As always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!